another video. And I got this guy sitting in with me again. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so this video, as you can see, I'm going to talk about AJ's fourth birthday. Oh my gosh, y'all. I cannot believe I have a four-year-old. My baby, my firstborn. He's four. What? Oh my gosh. AJ, how old are you? I'm four years old. Oh, very good. He is four. So let me tell y'all what's going on with AJ now that he is four. So let me tell y'all, he has been, this is the first time that he has, like he understands his birthday for the most part. Um, and because I'm not sure if he understands exactly what the birthday is. Um, but the birthday is the day that you were born, AJ. Well, I was born. Uh huh. Um, I need to teach him like the exact date. Um, yeah. Yeah. So he, for the first time, he has been like excited about his birthday and he's been asking when when is my birthday coming when is my birthday coming is it almost my birthday is it almost my birthday is it my birthday yet it's my birthday yet for like months ever since i would say since amir was born like since amir was born and amari's birthday so since november he has been asking non-stop every single day about his birthday and it finally came he even told us what he wanted for his birthday what did you want for your birthday i want some building trucks yep he wanted some building trucks so you know trucks for construction you know tractors and dump trucks and all of that so that's what he wanted he wanted all the and i was gonna carry some good shape and he wanted um some cake and a good good shape because he loves watching the movie good burger so he wanted a good shape so as far as development let me go over that first because i always like to talk about how my kids are growing and um growing and developing so first, so using the Tiny Beans app again, he's playing with my hair, please stop. So <laughs> using the Tiny Beans app, this is where I track everything as far as like um, their development and um, what they know how to do, what they're able to do, and um, I teach you your hair. what to look forward to, I what teach they, you your hair. okay, what's coming up with what they need to know how to do. So First up, let's see, AJ, he knows how to count and everything. So by now he's supposed to be able, I asked you to stop. So by now, um, he's supposed to be able to count to five. He can count way past five. Like he, he can count to 100 if we like just go all the way to 100. Yeah, you can count to 100, can't you? Can't you? Um, okay. Don't don't do it now. <laughs> One hundred. Okay. So the next steps um would be for him to start counting coins. So that's exactly what we're gonna be doing: learning um money and how to count it all. Um, he loves to talk, so his communication is perfect. He loves to talk. He can hold all kinds of conversations with anybody. Um, the next step would be to just prefer, perfect, I can't even talk, to perfect his grammar. Um, we're also learning um, Hebrew and learning Spanish. So I've already done a few Spanish lessons with him. And he's going to learn Hebrew as we learn it. <laughs> um he can use the restroom, you know, like, I don't mean like the little baby potty. I mean, he can actually use uh, the bathroom. Come on. Big people. Big people's bathroom. Big people's bathroom. That's funny. 
Um, so the next step would be, um, oh yeah, and, and brushing his teeth. Like he's good at that too. He brushes his teeth on his own. Um, cause I pretty much just explained to him how to do it the right way. And he, he does it. Um, he, he takes after me cause you know, you just tell me how to do something. I got it. And, um, so yeah, so the next steps, um, as far as fine motor skills would be drawing pictures. Do you know how to draw a person? You do? We're going to see. So I haven't seen you like draw like a person, like a smiley face and the body and the arms, and legs and all of that. Yeah. So AJ, he can climb, walk, run. He can do all of that all over the place. So his gross motor skills are, are very good. Now sit down. Um, so his next step with gross motor skills would be mastering the tricycle. So when it starts to warm up, we're going to get outside and we're going to really learn. That. He knows. Yeah, I want to do that. You want to do that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he knows how to ride um, his tricycle. He knows how to ride a bike. I want to do that. It's just, um, he just needs to master it. Like he'll do, do it that. a little bit and then he'll get like, he'll get stuck. But I want to do that. Yeah, too. you're going to do it. All right, so next. Oh, he can get dressed and he can it says a walk. He can get dressed and it he says a walk. I heard you. And he can name his age, as y'all already saw. Um, yeah. He likes to pick out his clothes. He knows what he wants to wear and what he don't want to wear. Um, just like the other day, he specified he wanted to wear pants that have pockets. Cool. <laughs> Um, so, yeah, so the next steps would be, um, learning his home address. So that's one thing we need to learn. We're going to teach him, um, his home address. So that's one thing we're going to work on in school. You hear me? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. So we're going to work on learning your address, mm -hmm. um, learning, a uh, phone numbers. Uh-huh. And learning phone numbers. Um, and actually, like next week, we're going to be working on problem solving. Like there is a problem. How do you fix it? So working with some puzzles and, you know, just doing some problem solving for his age. Um, let's see. Um, he can definitely repeat stories. Like if he's, we've read the story, you know, long enough, many times, enough times. He can repeat stories. He can hold up the books and, like, based on the pictures, pretend that he's reading, which I love that because that's a great step to learn how to read. So the next step um, that we are already start working on is sight words. So actually learning to recognize the words and um, know what they actually say. And he's done great with some already. He knows can and big he really knows big i don't know why that was the first word he just learned to recognize but he knows big he sees that word because when we have our circle time at school he um he recognizes big he was like i know that that's big um yeah you know the word big so he knows and can big n and of course a um potty training Okay, so AJ, AJ is obviously potty trained. He's been completely potty trained since he was three. Um, I would have preferred it be sooner, but yeah, it is what it is. Um, like he was potty trained before that, but just really getting good at it. Three, um, where we just pretty much didn't have to. My husband and I didn't have to think about it anymore. Um, so now it's just, just mastering it, you know, cause now that he's moved upstairs, he started getting in the habit of wetting himself all over again. And it's like, dude, what are you doing? So getting him back in the routine and, you know, just learning, you know, to control that. So yeah, so just perfecting the potty training.
when to go to the potty. Um, so let's see. The next thing is okay. Pa the parenting thing. So me instilling in him, you know, manners and all that stuff. So he knows how to follow directions. He knows how to follow multi-step directions. Um, and he loves to help out. He loves to help. Like he loves to help out with Amari. Like, um, just now I had to reach and grab him because he was ready to take off and go get on to Amari because he keeps slamming stuff into the wall and the door while he's back there playing. And, but I stopped him because he, you know, I didn't want him to go doing all that yelling while I'm trying to record. But yeah, he likes to do that. And he's also reminded me that we got to wash the dishes. So I'm like, yes, we're definitely going to get to that today because I didn't do it yesterday. because I didn't feel like it. But we're going to do it today. It's Look, six o'clock. I know it's six o'clock. So now he's telling me that it's six o'clock. That means it's time to eat. I told y'all before, these kids love to eat. Yes. They love to eat. Yes, y'all love to eat. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Mommy must make some good food. Good food. <laughs> yeah. So he can follow directions. So the next step will be what we're working on right now is um, following directions quickly. So, AJ, when I tell you to do something, how are you supposed to do it? Yes, ma'am. How are you supposed to do it? Fast. Yes, you're supposed to do it fast. What do you say when I tell you to do something? Yes, ma'am. There you go. Yes, ma'am. Do you cry? No. Do you say something back? No. Good, because that's another thing, him and his back talking. Like, I may say, AJ, go to your room and play. But he wants to tell me what he wants to do. I want to watch a movie, but I want a snack. No, no back talking. You don't tell me what it is that you want. Just follow directions. Because I'm trying to get him to understand that it will be movie time or TV time or snack time, dinner time, lunch time when I say it is time. Um, so yeah, so that's what we are working on. So his birthday, my birthday? no, not yet. Your birthday is already gone. I'm talking about your birthday. Oh. Yeah. So his birthday came and let me tell y'all what we did for his birthday. Okay. So first, um, we had his birthday breakfast. So we just picked up, um, some breakfast from IHOP and he had that. So we had um so I hop for breakfast um and then we opened presents. Well, he opened his presents and AJ, what did you get for your birthday? Some trucks. Got some trucks. Mm -hmm. So he got his building trucks. Um yeah. So he got building trucks and he got fire trucks, all of that and and some more stuff. He even got a racetrack. He got that from me, Ma. Yeah. So that was cool. So while he was eating breakfast, I was upstairs making over his room. Because remember, I moved him upstairs just kind of at a spur of the moment type thing. My original plan was to move him up there on his birthday. But because of the issue with Amari... I just went on ahead and moved him up there. So I hadn't fixed the room up or anything like that for him yet. So I did that on his birthday. So I'm like, so we can still do something with his room on his birthday. He can sleep up there, but I'll fix it up for his birthday. So while he was eating breakfast, I went upstairs and I made over his room. So I fixed up his room. And so when he was ready, when, you know, we got everything situated, um, Mimi came and brought her presents and he opened up those presents. And so when we finished with presents, then we took him upstairs to show him his new room, like his new made over room. And I actually have a clip of it right here. AJ's room before. And 
the after got his chair his toy box got his mat got his new racetrack his cars still got his basketball goal his clock his new bed set I gotta add the sheets on of course his car is lined up there his books his new chair his birthday poster from his third birthday so I saved it so I could put it in his room when he got his own room my big boy Face. All right, AJ, you ready for your next surprise? It's in your room, so come on. It's in, it's in, it's in, it's in the playroom. <laughs> it's not a playroom. It's your room. It's in my room. Uh huh. It's in your room. It's in that one. Yes. Your room. You ain't got but one. <laughs> okay, hold on. Wait, back up. Come here. Come here. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. All right, open them. And he left out and went downstairs. He did. I'm going to set this up so when you come up here. You watch that? <laughs> so that was his reaction to his new room. He loved it. Um, but the funny thing was, like, after he saw it, he was like, this is nice. This is nice. And he's like, okay, I'm going to go back downstairs now. And then he just walked right out. We're all standing there like, oh. Yeah. Okay. You done. I'm all right. So then after that, we got the boys all dressed. Um, uh, Amir, my baby, he went um, with uh, my mom, Mimi. So he went with my mom. And so we took AJ and Amari. We took them out to the movies because um, AJ has been into Sonic lately. And so then we saw that there was a Sonic movie coming out. We're like, ah, perfect. And it's coming out right before his birthday. So Sonic came out that Friday, and AJ's birthday was that mm. Sunday. So we took AJ out to the movies um, to go see Sonic. So we got popcorn and mm. drinks and sat down, and we enjoyed the movie. They did great. They enjoyed it. Did you like the movie? Yep. You like the Sonic movie? Yeah. Yeah. So then we left from Sonic, and we went to... Where did we go after um, we watched Sonic? Where did we go? Come here. To the popcorn store. Well, that was, the, that was where we saw Sonic, the popcorn store. He calls it the popcorn store. That's the movie theater. So where did we go after that? So we went to, <laughs> we went to um, Good Burger. Because he's been into Good Burger lately, too. He watches Good Burger every single day. Yeah. So we went to Good Burger. It was really Steak and Shake. So we took him there because um, he's been talking about he want a good shake. So I was like, you know what? Let's go to Steak and Shake. So we went to Steak and Shake and had um, had a good time there. Did you like Good Burger? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So he got his shake and he enjoyed it. So then after that, we went and picked up Amir and then came back home. And then he got to enjoy his favorite snack, which was boiled peanuts. So he Peanut. had some boiled peanuts and um, got to play Sonic on the Sega. Because um, we have a, a Sega game system. Um, 
kind of yeah. like uh I don't know what to call it, but it has like all the classic too. games on it and on it and all of that. So yeah, so and then we just we let him stay up late. So he got to have a day to just stay up late because he's always fighting and going to sleep. You get that from me, because I still do it. So he got a day to stay up late. So I have to say, this was a pretty awesome birthday. So I think he really enjoyed it which is why we are really working on the following directions and not back talking because a little bit um, it was starting to seem like all of that birthday stuff was starting to get to his head. So I need him to understand that, okay, now you got all of that stuff because of such a, such, because of the good job that you do. Bye. I can't get my words straight. Because of the good job that you've been, you've done. You've been doing great. So don't think that you got that and now you're supposed to get that all the time. No. So if you want to continue getting stuff like that, you got to continue to do what you're supposed to do and continue to do a good job and continue to listen. And you don't bad talk because bad talking makes mommy very, very not happy. <laughs> all right. So. So, I don't know what we're going to do for his fifth birthday, but I always feel like this. And we have these birthdays, and I'm like, oh my gosh, that was so awesome. We're not going to be able to top this. But we'll see. We're going to see. We are going to see. All right. So, that is AJ's fourth birthday. My baby is four. I have a four-year-old, yo. So, it has been four years now that I have been a mommy. Yeah, so his birthday, since he's my firstborn, his birthday is my mommy -versary. So, yeah, so I like to enjoy his birthdays, too, because that's the day I finally got to be a mom, finally became a mom. Because remember, I had two pregnancies before him, and I lost both of those babies, so yeah, his birthday is his birthday is always an exciting one. <laughs> it is. All right, AJ, you ready to say bye? Mm -hmm. All right, so that is all for this video, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye. bye.